There comes a point in your life when it's time to make amends for things that you've done or what you've not done. Like, I've got to make amends with Emma and Stephen, my daughter and my son. I start talking about things that I should have done, things that I promised. The broken promises. Time to heal all the, the past, the things that we've been through. The only way to get hold of Stephen is to get hold of Emma because she'll know where he is. It's hard to get through to Stephen. All Stephen is interested in at the moment is going out in gangs, getting drunk, getting in fights, getting as much bother as he possibly could because I think he tries to emulate me. So how have you been, Alec? Fine. How's he been? He's fine. What about you? <laughs> Torture issues. Yeah. Hi. Uh, what do you want? Uh, just coffee, please. Coffee, coffee for me as well, please. That'd be okay. great. I'm going to ask you. Some tap of hole there. Just standing. Stephen walking past her. I said, Bruce, just shout at him. Just ignore this. Run right past this. You tap the hole. I tap the hole. Right down the road in a way. What's the problem? What's the matter? With you? What do you expect? It's not as if you've been there, is it? I'll pass you by you. Oh, you're kidding me. Why was on the go? The things I'm doing. Can't stay out of trouble. Can't stay out of trouble. Keeping off the drink. Yeah, I know, but it's just we need to see you more often as well. Yeah, I know that I am. I'm going to have a huddle, see what he's doing, see what the problem is. Mm. See, Kevin's like, he's getting in a lot of bars. Be lucky if he speaks to you. Look at what he's like. Thanks, you're welcome. Thank you. Ah, so what are we going to do then? Hmm? Come and see you. The only really one kind that you really live with. You can't find all of this. Okay, I've not been there. Because I'm drinking all the time. Mm. Doing what I do. I'm going to change. Honestly, I swear to God, I'm going to change for you. Mm. Don't even worry about it. Because I'll be there for you. Ah, yes. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So the first step is going to do this thing, Stephen. Maybe you smoke in the night. John, you see Stephen a bit? Young Stephen. Yeah. Uh, he's here, he's a bit. Well, oh, this says he took off. He went a while. We're fighting or something. Yeah. Oh, here, look. Paul says he's seen him earlier on. Oh, here, walk up to the chipper. Toth. T O T H. Top of the hall. That's where I'm fed. That's where I'm heading, looking for Stephen. I wish it was me I was looking for. So I could just take myself out myself and say, what the fuck are you doing here? Get along the road. And then I wouldn't be looking for Stephen, would I? Because he wouldn't be in that predicament. Well, I was in the Toth years and years ago. Me and lots and lots of friends who are now dead. Stephen's running about with his gang because he wants to be like me and try and emulate his dad. And I didn't like it. And I didn't like him being in a gang. I only wish I'd get Stephen off the top of the hill. Bet something happens, bet somebody gets bad, someone done bad to them. At the top of the top of the hill, you've got your own lines, you've got your own borders. Same with any gang. You never go over the borders, go over the borders. You get filled in, see what is that? When somebody comes into your territory, then you've got to defend it. And the only way to defend territory is to fight. Because they would do the same with you. If you went to their patch, they'd keep fucking you in their patch. I've seen people getting stabbed, people battered with sticks, bats. Bottle attacks, glass attacks, knife attacks, really bad kick-ins. It's no very nice sight to see. It's a common occurrence on the whole team, on the top of the hall. It happens. You never hear about it, but it happens. At the time when it happens, people are full of bravado and adrenaline's pumping and they like to show off. Did you see what I done and I just done this and he done that? And... You know, I just thought the people that are doing it think they're going to hear a reputation for stabbing or slashing somebody. Most of the violence that is committed at the top of the hall by the kids is usually done through drink. They're all drunk. 
everybody at the top of the hall drinks. I've drank since I was about nine year old. I ended up in the hospital a couple of times you drinking, just stupidity. But then, what else is there to do? Get stuck in the drink and drug culture. Just one big vicious circle. You want to find somebody on the whole thing, you know where to go. Just going to the pubs, the same faces, just sitting there, day in, day out. The things I'd done years ago in gangs were idiotic and stupid. I used to get in a lot of trouble at the top of the hall myself. By just going at the pubs, going in there, starting trouble, fighting. Fighting the older men, a lot older than what I was at the time. It's not gonna end, like. Regrets. Got quite a lot of regrets. Look deep inside yourself and think about it and regret what you've done. I do. What have you fighting last night then? No camera the one? What happened? I can't remember. You can't remember. He was drinking last night. Dove stole him. Oh, yeah. The deal took me a while. He only had to wait for Sidon. Why did you go with him? He was stealing him. man. Why did you go with him? Come on, man. What's happening with the football then? I think you're going to go to Dundee. Going to See what a fucking chance we done. Oh. Yeah? Oh. Under 15s, is it? What do you mean? Well, I thought you were. You know what you're selling now, are you? Under 40s. So, what does Dundee train? James, you still play James, you still. Ah, you still read Dundee? Dundee West? Mm. Yeah. No. So, why are you now then? You gave up football, no? Let's see quick. There's something bad. I'm going to get back at the football team because we beat somebody on Sundays. Keep your mind off a drink when it's happening. So you get the ball. Wait for that up here, Michael. Later on, there's a guy. Never had him. I like bringing Stephen up here. Oh, he likes coming up here. He loves it. Yeah, he comes up here and he's completely different when he's up here. Can you see two boats? I can see them two boats. Right. I can see them two. No. Well, shut the fuck up and stop being a couple of dirties, Annie. Okay, I'm sorry, Steve. Yeah. Can you see it on it? There's six boats, is there? The two must be up there against the wall. Paul says there's two up there. Well, me and you go talk to them. Go on, Steve. Go on, Steve. Head towards the jetty. Because you've got the hook in your fucking head. Is that right? Okay, I'm saying that. It's only a hook. I'll rip your face. Just hold it into the fish, come. It'll go on if you want, Steve, but you want to go now? It's a short, Steve. Can do it. Yeah. I'm gonna the boat. The most annoying thing about Stephen is that he's a great wee football player. And it's just so sad to watch him destroying himself with drink when he should be out there playing football. I've never ever done it, so I can't play football. I couldn't have kicked a bar. And it's a shame to see the talent going to waste that he's got. So if I went out on the boat and put that on combat. When? Yeah, you have a phone, send a text or something. Who's that? Let's get you there. Steve, I'd put that back, yeah? My greatest dream for him would be for him to be playing for Scotland. Or playing for any great team. The only way I could get him doing that is by getting the mentality of gang culture out of his head. 
you, mate? You walk across that way, look down, up the side, other side. Ah! Wanna check his box, you've got any rattling in it? <laughs> Broke it. I don't know. Wait a minute till I put this on here, I'll hit the throat on like that. I think there's a bit of battery. Do you care, Dad? See if I hear that for you once more. That's three times you said that to me, right? What? You said it last week and you've said it a couple of times on the hall. No, I've no. Oh, you fucking have. I can't know what Arthur that is. Do you want me to go around his door and phone in or something? Eh? No, I was going to. What do you keep saying it for? What you want to do? You've said that before. I'm Your mum even saying... said that to you. Get a grip. No, didn't it? Shut up, you. Geez the fucking hand. You're horrible, we hang them. They're tasty as anything, look, they're good half its tail. Man, a lot of my mates have dead now. At the time when the day, you're like, oh, fucking hell, he's getting old. Dude. He was 29, or he was 27, or he was 23. Because you're only that age at the time and you think you're old. They were only burns. Still grown up. Still need to be shown the way. But what is there to show them the way? You, you kind of lose touch with everything that you've been brought up with. That is still part of you. The top of the hull is part of me. I'm part of the top of the hull. I stay at the top of the hull. I belong at the top of the hull. I've seen the best at the top of the hull. I've seen the worst at the top of the hull. Sometimes I can walk down that road and I'm lost. I think it's time for me and Stephen to step off that path and go a different route. Stuck on this path is just the road to ruin. And what I need now is to take Stephen away from the top of the hill. I want to make sure that my kids and my grandkids didn't make the same mistakes in life that I've made. And the saying in life is, what goes around comes around. 